Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Kelvin, um, back with another movie review redo. Uh, this one is for the 1994 uh, documentary Hoop Dreams, uh, directed by Steve James. Um, for those who don't know, um, I'm doing this new thing called Movie Review Redo, and it's basically me giving my take on certain films that I never got the chance to talk about. Um, but um, now that I have this platform, I want to talk about them. And for those who haven't seen uh, the movies that I do the, the review for, I suggest that you go watch these movies because these movies are just fantastic and, and they need uh, uh, another audience as well. Uh, Hoop Dreams, like I said, came out in 1994. It is a documentary and I will honestly say not only is this one of my favorite films, but it's one of my favorite documentaries of all time. Um, before anybody was talking about Richard Linkletter's uh, boyhood, how he followed this boy, and you know, from uh, child to teenage years and stuff like that, kind of forgot that Steve James did it with Hoop Dreams. Uh, but this isn't a written. Uh, fiction movie. This is a documentary. This is the real life story of uh, two individuals from the west side of Chicago, uh, William Gates and Arthur Agee, who uh, from the time they were children had these dreams of making it into the NBA. Um, you know, we go through their ups and their downs, their joys and their pains, uh, and life. And uh, I appreciate Mr. Steve James for giving us uh, a beautiful movie and a beautiful uh, film about the belief of dreams, uh, the movie about uh, what it takes to get there, even if you don't get there. Um, you know, this movie makes you laugh, it makes you cheer, it makes you cry because you are so invested in these these guys who you know are real people these guys are at you know this, like I said this is a documentary like these guys are actually real guys nobody you know they're they're not playing parts no one wrote a script for them this is this is really their life and and you get to see what life is like in the west side of Chicago you get to see talk about drugs and gang violence and and people who have these stories of they could have been in the position that these two guys are in but life happens to take another direction for you um, I really love this film so much and like I said it is one of my favorite documentaries of all time um, I can't say I can't I can't say more about who dreams I mean who dreams is like probably on everybody's list as one of their favorite documentaries. Um, it's a very touching, poignant uh, piece of art. And I hope you guys do get to, to, to watch it at least for those who haven't seen it. Um, you can, you can uh, rent it, you can buy it. I believe it's on Netflix, so check uh, Netflix to see if it's still on there. Um, but it's a fantastic film. And uh, tell me what you guys think. Uh, you can hit us up on Facebook at We Do Movies. And until then, we'll see you next time. Peace.